Hello everybody! Today I'm going to share with you um, how I do fish tail braids because I've like I've been promised you guys like I'm gonna do hair tutorials for you guys but I haven't been doing it so today I'm gonna do it first one would be fish tail braid so what we would need is just like a very easy I will just sweep my hair all the way to the side like that and then I will just separate my hair like so two equal parts like that fish tail braid is really very easy so you guys just follow my steps and you know how to do it how to do this fishtail braid and it's really very effortlessly cute and chic and very casual just take a little piece of your hair over here on one part like that and just go over like that so after you merge it to the one on your left can just pull another part from here like so and then just go over like that to the other side see it's really simple very very simple then you do this again from this bunch on the right pull a little piece to your left Merge it like that. Do it one more time. From the bunch on your left. Pull one little piece to your right. And then you can continue to do it. Okay, I'll show you one more time. From here, pull over to the side to the left. From the left bunch, pull over the right like that. It looks a bit messy, but I can assure you, you just have to tighten it, it will look very, very nice. But if you prefer it to look like a bit messy and casual, you can just go ahead and do it like that. of hair coming off like that sometimes it's like my fringe and sometimes it's because of my layer so it'll be a little bit frizzy or you can use like um like a frizz control lotion which i've mentioned in my june favorites if you haven't if you haven't been watching you can click over here take a look at the frizz free lotion frizz free lotion and then i've been like raving about it all the time and it's one of my favorites, my true favorites. Then, if you, if you have that, then you just apply a bit over here to control the face a little bit. Mama! Hello, Mama! Mama! Okay, so I'm gonna tie it now. <laughs> it, it'll be a, like, a bit messy. But this is like a casual, a really really casual fish to read. This is my end result. It's really really casual, but if you want to dress it up, you can go for a tighter fish tail braid. But this is the kind that I always go for because it's really really casual. I'm gonna do a close up to show you how it looks like. It's really really pretty. It suits my like my mermaid jelly. So I'm like a little mermaid, but my hair isn't great, so I'm not aerial. <laughs> okay, this is how it looks like. Very casual, very chic. And then I'm going to proceed. The second one 
I'm going to show you a really very very easy hairstyle I always go for would be Okay My hair tie really easy I will go for a bun Effortless bun What I do is Put my hair up like that Like so So I may just put down my hair, my fringe like that. If not, I will just put it all the way up. I'm having like a side parting now, so my fringe is almost side. Let's go. Very easy. Just use this. Like that. Okay, this is like my bun. Very, very effortless. Effortless bun like that. And it'll be like really messy like that. So from the side it will look like that. It's like a this one you can um even like rock it every day. Or if you feel hot you can even do this like that. Sometimes my fridge will be like up. If I feel like really really hot, I will usually I will just tie my hair like that. Then if you find that your fat your hair is really flat, just like pull a little bit here. Usually I'll just pull the top part. Top part like that. Okay, like that. Messy part. Okay. So this is my messy bun tutorial. I hope you guys really like it. The other one I'm gonna show you is like a hair braid, a little hair braid for my fringe. The things you need will be this, a bobby pin. Yeah, just one would do. And then a hair tie new. Very simple. You guys should really do this because it's like really good. And A side parting. I'm having a side parting now, so I would do that. I would just okay. Wait, no, I would do this. Let me see. Break my fringe. I used to do this um, in the past before I even started this channel, and um, people have been asking me how I actually do this fringe. Okay, I'm gonna grab one part over here. Can you tell? Just. Braid it like a normal braid. Separate into three like that. Okay. Pull over here. Pull over the second one. The third strand, you'll just pull over the side. Okay, I'll do like a zoom part so you can see. This side, you go over to the center one. Then this left one, you go back to the center like that. So you just go over like that. Okay. It'll be a little bit messy if um, your hair is really short fringe. So I recommend people to have like longer fringe, maybe until about here, so you can achieve this look. Uh, show you guys. So it's like a braid like that. Then usually until this part, I will just pull a little hair from here. Yeah, it's not part of the braid, so you just pull, just pull from here together with this. The one from the left strand. Then you just do according me lah. Just do according. So you're like adding to your braid, like so. In this part, then you do it again. From this, we just pull a little bit of hair. It's not in with the braid now, so I'm gonna add it to the braid so it look a little bit more voluminous. So add it here, and we we'll do the same thing again. Go over one more time, and then add a little bit more hair again. 
to just tie it with the braided part so you just go over and just tie it up like that the trick is do not make your hair your your hair or your head look very flat just go across like that you just pull up like that the other day my my brother even asked me how did your hair look so look so pong or like voluminous or like there's a bit of thing going on here at the scalp but so I just can you read the difference just pull it this part pull it to make it look a little bit trendy like that and my braided fringe should be like that and it's very very cute and chic can assure you it will be and one more trick to this hairstyle to make it even even more polished look you can hide your rubber band your hair band or whatever you need another bobby pin so there's two bobby pins for this hairstyle Okay, one little part over here. Go over the head in. Like so. And you just use your bobby pin to cut it. I'm not sure whether can you tell. But now my hair is hiding the rubber band here, and this one. and this it's my effortless hairstyle I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy this. So the first one is the fishtail braid, very casual, very summery as well. The second one it's my messy bun tutorial. And that's also very easy to do. So no excuses for you guys, for you girls, you pretty faces, to not have pretty hair. And then the third one is the braid, fringe braid. Very cute. If you want to pull your fringe out of your face, you can just do this braid alone and just leave your hair down. Then a twist to this will be to add a ponytail and to pull out your hair like that so your hair will look like it's very flat so i hope you guys enjoy my hair tutorial and if you tried this hairstyles good for you it's really very easy to um, achieve and if you did please comment down below and tell me what you tried and if it's really easy if you have followed my steps accordingly if you like this tutorial, please like my video and check out more videos over here. Click, 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 click. And I hope you girls are having a wonderful day. I hope to see you girls soon and have a wonderful day. Bye. Love you.